Rockers, welcome to Cream's Kiss Den, and today I am going to be talking about what your persona species says about you. Now, if you live under a rock or don't know what a fursona is, a fursona is an animal character used to represent yourself. For example, my fursona is obviously a dog. Also, a little disclaimer, these are just stereotypes. They won't be 100% accurate. Please don't get mad at me if I make a wrong assumption. All right, let's get started. If your persona is a wolf, you probably didn't put much thought into making it. Like, wolves are kind of the default persona species. Also, if you're a wolf, you think that you're more tough than you are. I'm sorry, it's just kind of a fact for most wolves. And if you're a wolf, you're a pack animal. You like, you like hanging out with a lot of friends. And those were the wolf stereotypes. Was I accurate? Did I get them right? Let me know in the comments. If you're a fox, you probably didn't put much thought into making your fursona either. Because foxes and wolves are just kind of like the default species, the most popular ones. If you're a fox, you are very easygoing. You go with the flow. And if you're a fox, you are probably very openly gay. I have never seen a straight fox before. And those are the stereotypes about foxes. Did I get them right? Did they apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your persona is a big cat, like a lion, a tiger, a leopard, something like that, you are lazy, just like a big cat. What figures? You're also... Your favorite movie is The Lion King, and... You have probably donated money for big cats. Were these accurate? Did these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your fursona is a cat, you are lazy, just like a cat. Even lazier than a big cat, in fact. If your fursona is a cat, you either watch too much anime or read too much warrior cats, or both. And if you're a cat, you're probably creative or artsy because a lot of animators and artists and fursuit makers I know about are cats. Did these apply to you? Are these accurate? Let me know in the comments. If your fursona is a rabbit, you're either asexual or very gay. I've not seen a rabbit that's anything other than those two. If you're a rabbit, you 100% love science. If you're a rabbit, you have definitely done a school project on rabbits. Did these apply to you? Were these accurate? Let me know in the comments. Alright, now this next one's kind of personal to me because my fursona is a dog. But if your fursona is a dog, you are a pack animal. You like hanging out with a big group of friends. You have too much energy and you are doggedly loyal. Teehee. Were these accurate? Did these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your fursona is a raccoon, you eat everything, you stay up really late, and you probably live in the city. Were these accurate? Did these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your fursona is a hyena, you are crazy. You laugh too much, and you have watched The Lion King way too many times. Were these accurate? Did these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your persona is a kangaroo, you have way too much energy, you like to hop around a lot and stuff, you probably have a cute Australian accent, and you are super optimistic. Were these accurate? Do these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your persona is a mouse, you are a short person, you are a nerd, and you are probably really cute in real life. Are you a mouse? Did these apply to you? Were these accurate? Let me know in the comments. If your fursona is a deer, you are skinny. You love winter and Christmas and stuff because, you know, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. And you hate bright lights because you're a deer. Were these accurate? Did these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your fursona is a shark, you are a nerd. You love swimming. Duh. And you eat too much. Also, duh. Is your fursona a shark? Did these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. Now, if your fursona is a zebra, 
you are athletic, you are a show-off, and you love donuts. Were these accurate? Did these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your persona is a bear, you are lazy, you eat too much, and you are a nerd. Were these accurate? Did these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your persona is a bat, you love Halloween, for obvious reasons, you stay up way too late, for other obvious reasons, and you are crazy. Were these accurate? Did these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your persona is a snake, you are crazy, you love summer, and you love tight hugs, like super tight hugs, like coiling your snake self around people and just squeezing them to death. Okay, that got dark pretty fast, but were these accurate? Do these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. If your persona is an otter, you love swimming, duh. You're skinny because, you know, otters are skinny. And you're a nerd. Are these accurate? Do these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. Finally, if your persona is a hedgehog, you are obsessed with Sonic, you love plushies, and you are a nerd. Were these accurate? Do these apply to you? Let me know in the comments. And that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video, got some entertainment out of it, and yeah, I sure do like judging people. So remember to like and subscribe and do all that stuff YouTubers tell people to do. So yeah, see you next video.